The 2022 NASCAR season across all three national touring series was undoubtedly a memorable one. Now, everyone is focusing on the upcoming 2023 season. However, one top Fox broadcaster won't be worried about NASCAR coverage in the coming months, as he surprised fans when he revealed his departure from the network on Twitter on the final day of 2022. NASCAR fans know that as much as they enjoy watching the sport on television, as in all sports, it doesn't come close to the full experience of being at a racetrack live. However, there is one major difference between NASCAR and other sports. Most race fans don't have the luxury of attending every race or even half of them, as the case is for stick and ball sports fans who have season tickets. In other words, being forced to watch so many races on television, fans hope that the viewing experience, while not as good as being there live, is at least enjoyable, and that comes down to the broadcast. As we discussed on this channel earlier this year, Fox had its share of on-air struggles in 2022 across all three series. I mean bad, embarrassing moments. Kevin Harvick was critical of Fox's coverage during the driver's only broadcast of an Xfinity Series race, and his frustration was undoubtedly reflected by the larger viewing audience who witnessed multiple moments this year during the race broadcast when the director and broadcasters in the booth were clearly not on the same page. Here's a quick example. 11 cars did as well. Bubba Wallace. Uh, Whoa, turn made, three. Uh, Bubba Wallace, speaking of that, man, I spoke too soon on that name. And he did not spin. He got a shot going into turn three from Ricky Stenhouse. Oh, okay. Fox's NASCAR coverage has, quite frankly, become comical, and most fans can't help but think it's by design. You have to look no further than the network's pre-race coverage, where someone decided it was a good idea to turn a watermelon seed from Ross Chastain's beard the week before into a character and run a skit on it, or the cartoon characters they use for the driver's profiles during the broadcast. William Byron playing Chuck Norris. You get the picture. And Fox's announcers, unfortunately, can fit that same mold. Vince Welch has covered NASCAR for more than 20 years. He's worked with Fox since 2015 as a pit reporter for the Xfinity and Cup Series. He also worked with the network as a play-by-play -play announcer for the Truck Series, where he's been a mainstay for the last couple of seasons. During his calls, multiple times, Welch has left fans bewildered by what he just said. There's more like this. Not surprisingly, with those kinds of blunders, the Indiana native has received harsh feedback from fans. Based on the latest news, it sounds like Welsh's critics won't have to worry about him anymore, as the veteran reporter made a surprising announcement on the final day of 2022 that it was his last day with the network. Today brings me to end of 2022 and my run at Fox. We'll greatly miss seeing those in the NASCAR garage, so many smart, selfless, hardworking people I respect. Network TV world is unique space, blessed to spend 20 plus years in it. Now onward, no bitterness. God is good, all the best to you. What's most interesting in the announcement, aside from the simple fact that it happened seemingly out of nowhere, is his word choice. No bitterness. That suggests, from his perspective, there could be some reason for resentment, but he's choosing not to have any. It sounds like this decision might have caught Welch by surprise. It certainly caught others in the industry by surprise, like driver Chase Elliott, who made it clear how they felt about the move. As he said, the network TV world is a unique space. There will now be a new face in 2023 leading Fox's truck series coverage. Kurt Busch did a good job in the booth in 2022. Jamie Little called play-by-play -play during ARCA series races this past season. Who will Fox choose as Welch's replacement? We'll find out soon enough. The truck series opens the 2023 campaign at Daytona on February 17th.